hello guys welcome back in this video we will explore the divider component from and design we will see how we can add the divider between different components how we can change its color how can we make the divider as a dashed line how we can add a text between the dividers and how we can uh, change the orientation of the text to the uh, left or right and in the last we will see how we can uh, use the uh, vertical divider between different components so let's get started i have an empty react.js project that is using and design and right now it is showing nothing so let's go ahead and import the divider component from and design and start using it so let's declare maybe a p tag with the text of problem epsom and another p tag with the same text and if i save it you see both p tags are there so uh, suppose we want to add a divider here so that will be divider and let's use the default props so this is how it looks like uh, a horizontal line with, with the grayish color so we can change its color as well by defining the and giving it a class for for this uh, css or we can style it uh, right here uh, so that will be a border color maybe you can say red so here it it is how it look like so let's add a few more okay so uh, uh, we can uh, instead of uh, the solid line we can make it the dashed as well so this is how it looks like let's change the color to be blue okay and then also uh, in the divider we can write the text as well so so that will be something we can say divider with the text of text here you go by default it adds the text at the center of the a divider so we can change its uh, orientation as well to left or right so let's add one more and we can sh say orientation is left so it will move that to left let's change it color to maybe orange okay let's add one more with uh, orientation to right here you go right and also we can change uh, uh, this margin as well so that will be orientation margin I suppose if it is for 3 so it will move to the first right and so it will margin from the uh, right so if I add suppose 150 so it will move 150 pixels uh, towards the other way so let's remove this one okay and here we see the the lines are horizontal uh, we can make the lines as vertical as well uh, so let's add uh, those so let's remove the text as well as uh, we can make it uh, the type to be uh, vertical so here you go between these two there is a vertical divider uh, let's change these to maybe we can say a link and link and let's add uh, both of these into a div so that uh, instead of the vertical alignment they, they go to uh, horizontal alignment and let's add span so that uh, those are just shown in line yep link pipeline and another link let's add one more here you go the vertical divider right so this is how we add the divider between different components Right, if, uh, right now you see there is a little margin here so that is the default margin we can change that margin as well so 
suppose we remove the margin from the very top divider here and there we can say if with the margin of 0 so it will be very close right so right now th this margin is because of the this p tag th this has a little bottom margin so that's why it's uh, a little margin here right so this is how we use the divider component from the end design if you have any questions please let me know in the comments below and if you have learned something in this video please hit like subscribe to my channel see you in the next video Thank you.